Hey everyone, it's Kelsey from Mattress Advisor. Today we've got the NOLA mattress in the Mattress Lab. Tune in as we put it to the test and then reveal our Mattress Advisor score. Before we jump in, here are a few things to know about the NOLA. The NOLA is a medium firm air foam mattress. A queen size mattress will cost you $850 and it comes with free shipping, a 120 night trial period and free returns. In fact, if you choose to return the mattress, NOLA will donate it to a local charity and you get all of your money back. Now that's something we can get behind. All you animal lovers are going to want to tune in for this next part. For every mattress purchase, NOLA adopts an endangered animal. And the best part is you get to choose the animal. We chose a penguin. The NOLA comes compressed and rolled up in a box. Although a queen mattress weighs 73 pounds, the handles on the side of the box made lifting easy and setup simple. It took us less than two minutes. The NOLA was a little smelly initially, but the scent went away in a couple of hours. So for ease of setup, we give the NOLA a nine. Let's take a look at how the NOLA measures up in our motion transfer test. Motion transfer plays a pretty significant role when it comes to an uninterrupted good night's sleep. What we mean by motion transfer is the amount of movement you feel when your partner changes positions or starts monkeying around in the middle of the night. The less movement you feel, the better your Z's. We will first conduct our wind test to assess motion transfer. Aside from being the best way to wind down after a long day at work, a glass of wine is a great visual indicator of how much motion is being transferred from one side of the bed to the other. We had RJ lie down and roll back and forth a few times on the other side to see how much the glass and the wine inside of it moved. The wine remained pretty steady, so we gave it a nine for this test. Well, cheers to that. Next, we took a more human approach to measuring motion transfer. This time we replaced the wine glass with an actual person to see how much movement they felt. We had both RJ and Asha rate this on a scale from one to 10, with 10 being no movement at all. They both gave it a nine out of 10. So for the combined motion transfer test, the NOLA gets a nine out of 10. Can you remember the last time you fell out of bed? Maybe from a nightmare or too many glasses of wine? Whatever the case, Hopefully it's been a while. You have edge support to thank for that. If you tend to find yourself sleeping on the edge of your mattress or use the end of the bed to get ready in the morning, then you will want to pay attention during this next test. First, we ask RJ and Asha to sit on the end of the bed to tie their shoes. We had them rate the level of support on a scale of one to 10, with 10 being extremely easy with exceptional edge support. They gave it a collective nine out of 10. Next, we asked them to lie on the edge of the bed in multiple positions, side, stomach, and back, to see if they could sleep in that position comfortably. They both gave it an eight out of 10. So for total edge support, the NOLA gets an 8.5 out of 10. Next up is our pressure relief test. Let's see how the NOLA measures up to pressure. We test pressure relief by using a pressure mapping film that shows how much pressure is placed on different parts of the body. Here's what you need to know. Blue spots are good. They mean that mattress is evenly distributing your body weight. The red spots, on the other hand, are bad. They show us areas of high pressure. It is particularly important to see low pressure around the hips, thighs, and shoulders. When RJ and Asha were on the NOLA, we saw warm colors on their shoulders and hips. So we gave the NOLA a 7.25 out of 10. Did you know that keeping a good posture while you're sleeping is just as important as keeping it during your waking hours? For every mattress we test, we take a look at how well it keeps your spine in a straight line. We had RJ and Asha lie down on their sides and once they were settled, we took a close up of their backs to see the alignment. Ideally, we want to see a straight line from the spine all the way up through the neck. The NOLA was just a hair away from keeping the spine in a perfectly straight line. So it scores a 9.5 out of 10 for this test. Not too shabby. The mark of a responsive mattress is one that adjusts or responds well to different sleeping positions and movement while you sleep. So we had RJ and Asha lie on the NOLA in each sleeping position, back, stomach, and side. As they changed positions and got settled in, we asked them how the mattress adjusted or responded to their movement and how long it took for them to feel settled in. They rated the experience on a scale of one to 10, with 10 being it adjusted perfectly and instantly to the new position. The NOLA seemed to respond pretty well. RJ and Asha gave it a combined 9.25 out of 10. Now for the best part, the reveal of our Mattress Advisor score for the NOLA mattress. 
Our score is a weighted average out of 10 that incorporates functional and performance characteristics of the mattress, as well as a social responsibility score, which measures social mission, community involvement, and charitable partnerships. Can I get a drum roll, please? The Mattress Advisor's score for the NOLA mattress is an 8.9. That's it for the NOLA. Thanks for tuning in today. If you want to take a deeper look at any of these scores, just hop on over to the full NOLA review at mattressadvisor.com. As for me, I am going to take a load off on my NOLA mattress.